actually pretty much every sound is produced this way in the studio. You have a drum kit and then the engineer would mix it and apply different effects and produce different styles of music. But you can also do this with guitars, pianos, organs, strings. Um, guitars in particular, having the some of the, some of the amp simulation from Amplitude inside allows you to do a lot of really cool things. For instance, uh, okay, I have this electric guitar here, and I'm going to grab some of the elements from Amplitude that we have inside. This is the uh, I have the preamp and tone section here. I've got a spring reverb and a cabinet. These are modeled cabinets where we can change the size of the cabinet and uh, produce this. I can go into the preamp here and choose different settings. Okay, I can also grab, let's say, a uh, phaser. Okay, and I can change the cabinet size. Okay, I can choose uh, the mic type, condenser or dynamic, near or far, off axis, on axis. And I can change different EQ models, tube EQ. So there's a lot of things that I can do. Um, the other thing that I like about Sample Tank 2 is every parameter is MIDI controllable. Uh, this is great for creating your own unique performances. For instance, I can grab MIDI control here and it have the mod wheel adjust the rate of a phaser. So I can do... You can also do this with all the synth parameters and create your own sound out of these uh, instruments that are included. As a matter of fact, the way that I look at the library is uh, you have 1,500 sounds, and for if you're the type of person who just wants to have a lot of inspiration instantly and write songs, this is a, a great, one of the best uh, pieces of software that you can get for that purpose. But it's also, if you're adventurous and you like to uh, shape the sounds in your own unique way, uh, Sample Tank 2 offers basically those 1,500 sounds as starting points for creating your own uh, instruments. Uh, for instance, I've taken sounds like uh, this basic shakuhachi uh, sound here. Okay, and I can take that sound and turn it into... Okay, but I can go in and grab, for instance, uh, distortion. Let's see. And uh, maybe a phaser. And a delay. And filter it as well. And turn that shakuhachi into maybe use the mono legato mode here with portamento and turn that shakuhachi into this sound. Now what you're seeing me do here is play with the harmonics in real time.